What is going on, everybody? Another episode of Starship Evo. A little bit of dev. And as you can see, we have something familiar here, yet unfamiliar in the Starship Evo world. Let's take a closer look. As we get in, we're going to start realizing that we are looking at a racetrack, ladies and gentlemen. And after a little bit of R&D, precisely about a week of tweaking, I've created two modules, an elbow and a straight line, both with gravity that are actually giant platform ships slash hoverboards that you can place anywhere on Earth or in space. And you can make any track you want, and then you can race. And we got landing pads, and for now, we got up to four people that can race. And uh, already working on some fun things like uh, pop up uh, auto turrets to just start shooting at you. And obviously, guns are enabled. Uh, no shields on the track yet. Gonna be setting those up. I need to see how that works uh, in order to figure out if we can actually shoot each other without like shooting up the track. Uh, more R&D on that, but let's get right to it. So I'm going to go ahead and request a landing. Uh, because this isn't actually a, a supported feature, uh, we kind of got to hack into it a little bit, okay? Not going to lie. I mean, it'd be dope if Tsuna likes it so much and the community's like, yeah, we want some F-Zero Starship Evo in space. So, you know, f Stevo or maybe that's just the wrong message. But so what you do is you land as a ship. And you need, you need whatever ship to be made as a hybrid. So it needs to have two yaw sticks. So I'm going to undock. I'm going to stabilize. Hit tab. And here I'm going to make sure that I'm at around 2.5 meters. And I'm going to quickly disconnect and reconnect. Now it's going to do a little clipping. It's not going to like it. But see, then it stabilizes. And now we're happy. And essentially, this is where the race starts. So you can get a countdown. Uh, I found that if somebody's manning the the yaw for uh, the hoverboard, the, the the hover ship, which is the green one you see in the distance, everything seems to be a bit more stable. But on my own, I am able to achieve a few things. Let's take a look. And so keep in mind we're in space. I'm using a hover. Um, I think I'm missing a few modules here because I came up with the stability factor afterwards. Yeah, and so right here where you see the crashing is where I haven't really set up the power and the secondary modules. But as you can see where I have set up the secondary modules, it's quite stable, right? So there's a section right here that I haven't done, but I'm going to standardize it on the pieces. As mentioned, ah, this is a tough turn. As mentioned that I added, I realized that I needed to turn it into a giant hover plat and ship platform after the fact. Um, and that's the elbow joint that I haven't standardized. So I'm going to be spawning one of those and remaking a track with those spawned in. Woo, this is a tight turn. And uh, yeah, so there you go. Uh, you can have these really interesting F-Zero type races. Now, the gravity, I haven't managed to figure out quite how it works. Because originally, I had these upward slopes and downward slopes well frame rate is suffering um i had these upward slopes and downward slopes but it, i'm having issues having gravity catch me uh so if the, if the ground drops then my ship will just go straight and i've tried doing double or triple gravity and it just doesn't work um so maybe if we get community support on this soon it can create some variabilities where we can actually, you know, do loop the loops, corkscrews, and really create interesting, fun tracks, like with child entities and whatnot. Like, I'd be really into that. So if you guys like this, comment down below uh, and add a suggestion uh, on the GitHub. And uh, for those of you who have no idea what this is, this is Starship Evo, spaceship voxel building game, but you can kind of make what you want. And I've been having fun making this track so here you go folks that has been the track and as i crash into the wall i'm just going to disconnect from here there you go and so this was today's track kind of a short video showing you 
the R and D we've been doing here at over at MB Works. And uh, yeah, there we go. So thanks. Please comment, like, subscribe, join the GitHub, download, buy the Starship Bevo if you like it. You could join us on Discord. It's on um, Steam pre-release and uh, early access. Sorry, I mean, and uh, the link will be in the description down below. MB Works signing out, and I'll see you in space. Peace out.